So a few different possible pathways for procritinib in addition to what we saw with Persist-1. There is a second phase three study ongoing, which is Persist-2. Uh, this study uh, allows patients who have been previously exposed to JAK inhibitors uh, and or failed either ruxolitinib and or other JAK inhibitors. So we're really looking at it in the second line setting uh, as well. Uh, Pacritinib will be looked at in combinations in a variety of settings for patients with myelofibrosis, uh, but potentially has activity in other diseases as well. As a FLT3 inhibitor with a good safety profile will be explored in acute myeloid leukemia. There's actually some ongoing studies, uh, as well as potentially a loner in combination in other solid tumors in which JAK inhibitors have been seen.